Just gonna check that everything is okay. Um, do, 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 do. I'm so tired right now. <laughs> Stayed up till three playing Minecraft. So okay, <laughs> we good, we good. So let's see. Good morning, everyone. Um, this is Alex the Sudoku, and it is Sunday the 9th of May 2021. Let me just time my hair back as well. And we're going to do today's New York Times hard Sudoku. I um, hope my voice is okay, but suffice to say I'm quite tired. Uh, so we're just going to deal with the New York Times hard Sudoku and see how we do. Uh, we're going to do some Snyder notations where we pencil mark in two, um, anything where we have two candidates within a cage, basically. But we're going to do it one number at a time, starting with the ones, and then move up to the twos, and then gradually finish up to the nines. So we've got a two over here because I've got four different twos looking into this um, box. I'm going to say boxes now, either box or block. Um, okay, so anything else on the twos? Nope, can't see that. So, pencil mark in some threes, threes. Got three over here, which unlocks the three. And I think it's time for the fours. Good morning, Emily. How are you? I hope you're well. I hope you're less tired than I am. I am <laughs> extremely exhausted. Um, I had a midnight session of, um, Minecraft and it went as well as one would expect from someone who's a scaredy cat and um, who hasn't played Minecraft in many years and uh, it was good fun though it was good fun so I'm just going to pencil mark in some the triple here which reveals a seven and I've got a seven up here thanks to these two sevens and these two sevens so how are you? I hope you're well. Hope you're well. Uh, got some more sevens and sevens here. Seven, seven, seven. Seven. Fantastic. I'm glad you're well. Glad you're well. I hope. Um, I hope you had a good start to the weekend, and you've got plenty more of it left. Got to have eight over here. I think that's all the eights I can pencil mark in. Moving on to the nines, nine, nine, nine. Actually, I've got a pair here of sevens and six. Let's pencil mark those in. And the one and eight gives me a triple down here, which are two, four and nine. And that should give me another nine. And these are therefore sevens and sixes, six and sevens. Okay. You had your first day of work. Congratulations. How did you find it? I say congratulations. I don't know if you enjoyed it at all. Um, work is an interesting experience, I have to say. After like 15 years or... Yeah, reckon about 15, 16 years of it. Still can't get used to it. It's just not natural. 11 hours. Oh my God. That is a long shift. May I ask what you did? What did you do? Uh... You don't have to share, but um, yeah, just out of curiosity, um, if you're happy to share, because that is quite a long shift, and it'll be especially long if you um, if you have to be on your feet, basically, which a lot of retail jobs involve, and I just think it's not right. I just don't think it's right at all to make people stay on their feet all day long, so I hope that's not it. Three, four. So I'm just doing a second scan to see if I can find any more numbers. I can already feel like my nose is blocked up. My nose is bunged up and I don't know why. Got a pair of fives here. Um, is that meaningful, that pair of fives? I don't think it is. Sixes. Hold on a sec, hold on a sec. No, I've got a six in this case already, which gives me a pair of sixes over here, sixes over there. So what does that mean? Well, that means we've got an X-wing of sixes, meaning the sixes have to be on this column. Um, 
Do we care to press the button? Cashier the local pool. Like the last year. You just did the answer, answer phones. Okay. I will allow it. Just this once. I will allow it. <laughs> did you have fun? Fun is a weird word. I'll say weird way of putting um putting work because some work can be fun, but in this day and age, it's very hard to um, because a lot of people they don't work for their passion. They work for survival, basically. And um, yeah, so people keep talking about, you know, you've got to find a job that you love. If you love your job, it doesn't feel like a job at all. Um, it's a very privileged position to be able to say that. Um, I certainly enjoy a lot of my work, but that's not to say, you know, I enjoy working necessarily because of the um, things I have to deal with, basically. But, um, but yeah, it can it can be okay, I suppose. Uh, I've got five and six in here. That doesn't that doesn't work too well. The people you work with make it fun. That is good. That is one thing they never tell you. Even if you're passionate about something, I'm going off into my rants again already. Um, something that you're passionate about, like um, just ask any artists who um, work in arts for a living. It does actually kind of like beat the passions out of you. Um, actually, I think we have a number here. We have a naked single here. The reason I think, no, it's not a naked single. It will be a pair potentially. So what am I missing? Nines and fives in this cage. So nine can't go there. Five can go there. So one, four, five, eight, and nine. Four, eight. I'm going to have to look at the rows and the columns, I think. Um, cause I think the secrets are lying in wait in those places. But I'm not quite sure where it is. I want to find somewhere that's got high probability. Why are my fans, why are the fans in my computer spinning so hard? Um, four, five, six, and eight. I've got four and eight there. But that's not four and eight. Okay. Looking at the quadruples, if I can. Do, 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 do. This is a triple of one, five, and nine. Ended up not being useful, actually. No, we can't find. I'm going to pencil mark in the nines in this cage. Sorry, this box, because um, they don't clash too much. And yeah, I can't I can't see anything obvious. So I'm gonna start looking at the pencil markings of the anything that has two pencil markings. I'm gonna see if I can find any thing of interest. This is a 159 triple. Um one, two, three, four, missing a five, got six, seven, don't have an eight. So it's five and eight. So how are the five and eight looking in this box in general? Not amazing. One and four. One and four can't go there, but that's meaningless. Six and eight. Six and eight. Not useful. Am I missing something? I feel like I'm missing something. Seven and six. Nope. One and eight. Seven and six. Six and seven can't go in those cells. Can't go here. Can go in these, so that makes uh, maybe a free. Oh, hello, hello. There's a three, six, seven triple on this column because threes, sevens, and six can't go can't go in those two cells. So actually, there's a piece of logic we may be able. No, no, there's no special logic. Seven can't go there. So, but this is a three, six, seven triple, which means these are one, eight, and three, six, three, six, seven. Those must be one eight and one eight and five and five can't go in this cell, but it means five can't go there anymore. So the fives have to be in these two cells because of the three six seven triple, leaving one five and eight. Um. So that's got to be five and eight. And then is that useful? 
feeling skeptical. Oh, hello. No, no, no. I got excited for nothing. A common theme here. So one five and eight, one five and eight doesn't actually bring us joy. Um, that's disappointing. That's quite disappointing that um, that doesn't resolve. So maybe the three and six. No, three, six, seven here. No, this doesn't actually bring us anything. Have we got a tough puzzle here? Okay, let's try something else. Can we find... Got four and eight there, so... Nope, there's no four-eight pair up there. And a bit of a conundrum here. Hold on, five, five, six... Oh, hello, I've got five and eight there. Overseeing that cell, so this is six and nine. Is that useful? Five, six, seven, so this is five as well. Five. Wait a sec, can that still be a five? No, we can't. Fives are locked in these two cells, so fives can't go in this cell. So, so there are no fives. There are no fives here, which means there has to be a five. Right, let's think about this logic. I've got three, six, seven, triple here because six, seven, and three can't go up in these three cells, right? As a result, I've got one, five, and eight, and this can't be a five, so that forms a pointer pair of fives here, meaning there are no fives down there, but also that means there are no more fives within this cage, and as a consequence, these can't be fives, that can't be a five because it is five, this is the only place for the five. I don't know, I don't know what logic we call that, but um, it's a bit of logic. So with that, I'm going to question my sanity because the fans are spinning hard in my computer, and I don't know why. Um, okay, let's see. Let's see if that does anything for us by placing that five. We've placed a four as well, which means there's another four down here that unlocks a four. So four for four. Um, also, this can't be a four anymore. Okay, okay, that breaks the two and four, meaning I've got another two down here, two over there, two and six are now broken. Six, 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 that means, means that's a six. And, okay. <clears throat> this is now a pair as well as that, so this pair is ones and nines, and that must be threes and fives. So let's pencil mark those in. Um, anything else interesting going on? Five, nine. Let me have a sip of water. Oh yeah, I was going to say earlier, going back to the last message, that, um, you know, the people, working with good people, um, makes a massive difference. It's the people you work with, with that makes a difference about whether you enjoy your job or not and not the work itself. That's what I was going on about. Um, and I just got completely sidetracked, just ranting about, um, ranting about how enjoying, being passionate about your job isn't enough. It's the people, it's the people that makes it. So freeze, three, 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 freeze it down here. Just doing a second scan basically, or maybe a third or fourth, I don't know. I don't know what scan this is anymore. I think my life is a, is a lie. But that's okay. Okay, we've got a six here because I've got we've got an X wing of sixes, so the sixes have to be in these two cells. Therefore, six is here. I think I had an opportunity to pencil mark in the six as a triple earlier, and I didn't. So I think that would have kind of identified a six earlier. So eight goes there, which means the eights are now in these two cells. Let's pencil mark them in. That six also means the si oops, the sixes are here, which doesn't reveal anything. Moving on to the sevens, sevens are now pointed here. In fact, I'm going to mute. Hopefully, that clears my nose a bit and I can talk in a more normal voice. So I've got sevens. Um, anything else? 
they said sevens. Oh, I think that's it. Uh, that's a bit disappointing. What about the eights? Eights? No, nothing on the eights. Nines? Nine, nine, nine. Come on, give me a nine. Nine. Morning, Sapsi. How are you? So I had a I had a long session of Minecraft last night. I think it was like two hours, maybe. Two or three? No, at least three hours of Minecraft last night. I think I understand a bit better, but there's still so much. There's still so much to do in, in Minecraft. So, but I think, I think we're prepared. And um, my friend Rose has created a server. It was late. I started at probably at 11 or something like that. Um, it was a late stream, so it's understandable you didn't see it. Um, but yeah, my friend Rose um, set up a server for us. And um, friends can join, basically. So I'll have to ask her to give you an invite at some point. Oh, I've got threes in these two cells now. But I think I just need to look at the rows and the columns. And um, yeah, 11 is midnight for you. So <laughs> it's totally understandable. Uh, five and nines in these cells. Does that bring us joy? I'm not feeling, feeling very joyous right now very disappointed at the nines that has not resolved itself what is going on uh, I think I need to look at the rows and the columns don't I so let's try and do that probably want to look at the columns uh, well there's a number sitting right here so if anyone has been kind of like screaming at the monitor even if it's internally uh, please do let me know in the comments below on YouTube <laughs> Uh, I've got one in nine now, one in nine. Um, one, three, and seven. I've got three and seven there. One, three, and... S oh, no, hold on. Three can't go there anymore, so it's not one, three, and seven. The threes are now officially done. It's one, seven, and nine. Okay. Got a seven there, so seven's over here. Nines. Nope, that's not useful. It's not useful, but I'm going to pencil mark in the nines anyway. Five and six means this half... These have to be nines, which means that can't be a nine anymore. Um, these are, in fact, nines and ones. Hey-ho, another set of ones, but oops, that means the one and eight are resolved. Oops, unlocking the eight over there. Eight and nine. Nine down here. And a nine here. One here, seven there, which means this is a one and a nine and a nine and a one. And we've got one and a five. No, hold on. That doesn't have to be a five. Yes, it does. That's the only place left for the five. So five and six and six and seven and six and nine, leaving me with six and seven and six and five. And that, my friends, is today's New York Times Hard Sudoku. We enjoy that. And um, if that helped you in any way at all, dissolving today's New York Times Hard, Please leave a um, comment below, or no, put a like below. If you dislike it, leave a comment and hit the dislike. That's what that's for. And um, and if you want to see more, please subscribe. But meanwhile, I'm going to continue doing the mini crosswords and the spelling bee as well. So if you want to stay with me, you can watch me embarrass myself in um, failing to do this. So hit the more, I guess, shop. Capital of 19 countries. Capital of 19 countries. Hmm. Interesting. That makes me think it's a place that has many countries within it. It's a country of lots of countries in a way, but... It's not going to be Rome, is it? Breed of black cattle. Bulls? Oh no, stag? No. What the cloud... Thank you. I do need the luck. Thank you very much. What the cloud stores data? Black gemstone. Black gemstone. Um, ebony, obsidian, black gemstone. I honestly don't know. Mermaid's home is the sea. Something, something, some, something P, 100% in slang. What? Howdy? <laughs> Uh, heart or lung is an organ. In an in a sullen mood, 
in a sullen mood. I'm not sure exactly what that means. So I'm going to leave that jazz instrument for short. It's a sax for saxophone. So it's not Rome. It starts with an E. Capital of 19 countries. Interesting. Breed of black cattle. Is that going to be Angus? Angus beef is the thing. So that's my guess. Oh, this is Onyx. How did I forget Onyx? So something P. Handu. Hondu. Hondu. Hindu. Hindu P. 100%. Oh, Hundo. Hundo, hundred percent. So Hundo, I guess Hundo P. So I guess this is Euro. Euro is the capital of nineteen countries. Oh, capital as in currency. Cheeky, that's very cheeky. New York Times. Oh, hello. We've got a difficult puzzle here. Saturday, the fourth of April from twenty twenty. So raisin grape prune. I'm guessing this is date. Spanish for egg, I have no idea. Composer wrote his first concerto at the age of five. Is that going to be Mozart? Mozart. Is it Mozart or Beethoven who... Good deed. Gesture? Um, Annie, who hit the edge side of the playing card from 30 paces away. Who? Knight's horse. Is a steed, I guess. Uh, put into words is, I guess, says. Fun diversions when you're stuck at home. Fun diversions when you're stuck at home. Interesting. Like trees in the summer, provide shade. Maybe prune is incorrect. Maybe it's not date. Like trees in the summer. Green? Leaved? A bit of light blocked by the sunscreen. UV. Oh, hello. UV light is blocked by sunscreen. But insect drawn. Ah, this is a moth. So everything is wrong here. Is this going to be plum? Oh, hang on. Moth still works. For Mozart. So let's try that again. Fun diversions when you're stuck at home. It's not pizzas. I, I, I'm still skeptical. It's um, Mozart now. Like trees in the summer, leaved. Yes, that works. UV ray. So it's Mozart, but I have no idea what um, the P is about. Computer uses shortcut uh, hockey. Should know this one. I use a lot of keyboard shortcuts. Um, Mazda sports car is. Don't really know my cars. Tree trunks, tree trunk grove. Oh. Is this going to be moss? Like, do moss grow on tree trunks? Spanish for egg, I still don't know. That one good deed. Hmm. Good deed. The V A H throws me off. I think something is wrong there. Annie, yeah, I'm not going to get that. Fun diversions when you're stuck at home. What? I'm going to close the iPad. It's not actually helping me. Fun diversions for when you're stuck at home. Okay, we're going to do a quick check. Everything is correct. What the hell? What the hell is that? Good deed. Uh, fun diversions when you're stuck at home. So I guess this is relevant because of lockdowns. So. Puzzles. Puzzles is... Um... So what the hell is this then? Good deed. Honestly, don't know. I'm going to go for moss for this. That's the only thing I can think of. So, I guess Annie Oakley? And then... Master Sports Car. Um... Is it going to be a vowel? 
A B C D E F G H I. I'm gonna put an I in there. Oh, it's an I. Meter. Meter. Let's have a look. What the hell is a meter? That's a meter. MX Master MX5 meter. Okay. And what the hell is a mitz mitzvah? Oh, is this the? It's a Jewish thing, isn't it? Bar mitzvah. So mitzvah. In the second meaning. Yeah, it is in Jew Judaism. So wow, that's a lot going on. It refers to a deed performed in order to fulfill such a commandment as such a term mitzvah. It's also come to express an individual act of human kindness to keep in keeping with the law. Okay, so good deed indeed. So with that done, we're going to go into the spelling bees and see if we can get today's pangram. Um, glowing? No, I see glow. I can see wick as well, so... Hmm. Let's see. See block? But it's not... Oh, there is an ING. In that case, it's blowing. There we go. I feel I need to go back to napping because I'm so tired. I'm so tired. But thank you for watching. For anyone on YouTube, please leave... Um, no, what's the word? Smash the like and subscribe, as the kids say it. Um, but yes, if there's anything you want me to do with the Sudokus, or if you want to suggest a Sudoku, uh, come join my Discord. Um, maybe I should re come to no, come to Twitch, come to Twitch, and then you can talk to me, and then you can um, see the. I kind of don't want to leave my Discord on YouTube actually, so people come to Twitch, they can see my Discord. But um, yeah, thank you for watching. If it's been helpful, please do leave a like, and um, if you want to see more daily New York Times puzzles, please leave a subscribe, and um, I shall see you tomorrow. Anyone else on Twitch? Um, hello, we've got three, three viewers, so why don't we do a bit of a raid? Actually, no, I am going to do it on a different window. Um, Plasmophobia, Rogue is playing, but since we're doing Sudokus, let's see if there's any other people doing Sudokus at the moment. Um... Looks like it's just me, and I thought I follow puzzles categories. Apparently, I don't follow the puzzles category. So, puzzles. As a category? No. Where's the category? I've got channels, categories. Are there no puzzle categories? Because that's a bit rubbish, I have to say. Oh, five more categories. No, these are games. So, crosswords, maybe? Crosswords. There we go, crosswords. Uh, wow, no one is playing crosswords at all. So, I'm afraid there's no one else to raid. Hey, thanks, Epsi. Uh Let's see. Should we raid? We'll, we'll just raid Rogue and Rhino, because he's now at... 17 hours out of 24 hours for his um, 24 hour stream. So we're going to raid him. I feel really bad. I'm going to be lurking again because, oh, I need to go shopping. Oh, it's light outside. Very bright. That completely messed up my exposure. So yeah, thanks for hanging out. I'll catch you guys on a flippy flop. Right now?